teenager comes face to face with a man breaking into her home. Tonight, a West Omaha woman says she's the victim of a very similar crime. Here's Jim Sidelecki's burglaries and break-ins. You've got to be kidding me. And they were valuable to me, but I wouldn't think anybody else would want to steal my shoes. Sarah was more than surprised to see what the three guys who broke into her home were really after. It's freaky. And don't forget the earrings, bracelets, and necklaces. Emptied out my duffel bag and then put my jewelry in it. Sarah says she thinks something spooked these guys. That's why she still has all her shoes and jewelry. Stuff was staged in the garage. They did get away with one TV, but these guys were a bunch of hacks, amateurs. They struggled with this wall mount and just left the bedroom TV dangling. Same story in the basement where the flat screen is crooked, but still here. Sarah knows this could have been worse, and thanks to a neighbor's security system, police have a great lead. The crime scene lab has been given the videotape so they can clearly see uh, the perpetrators coming in my house, uh, opening up my garage door and driving their car in my um, garage. That video has already been turned over to police. I think it's just a matter of time before they get caught. An arrest will bring peace to Sarah and keep this group of thieves out of her closet. Amel DeMarcus does not have anything on me. In Southwest Omaha, I'm Jim Sidelecki, Channel 6 News. Sarah.